Yeah, I fucking die. Like, I literally fucking, bitch, why are you saying this bitch pussy is long? That is rude, bitch. You can't say, like, if you say a nigga dick small, that's fine. But if you say, bitch, yo dick fucking, like, skinny, or you say, bitch, yo fucking balled up dick ass, like, bitch, that's like, like, yo, bitch, yo, yo fucking dehydrated ass dick. Like, if a bitch said this to me, bitch, you gonna get smacked the fuck up, bitch. Who's you talking about? Not this one over here, baby. We big packing over this motherfucker. You can never play with me. So if that bitch, every time you see her, that bitch say your pussy is dehydrated. Bitch, what? My pussy, this bitch, what? Look, bitch, you got your ass. Hot me, hot me, hot, bitch. That bitch say hot me, hot me, hot. Bitch, she say hot me, hot me, hot. <laughs> Look. Yeah, bitch. Uh -huh. Bitch, try again. <laughs> Here ye, yeah, bitches. We I got to hear to you today. Let's talk about the following episodes of One More Chance that I have missed. I have supposed to been on my shit with these One More Chance episodes, but y'all know a bitch is good in the motherfucking lab. I got shit dropping soon. Bitch, I just become a trap star today. Y'all know the inside scoop, so I'm gonna get y'all the inside scoop, bitch. I just started selling motherfucking weed. Yeah, I did. Cause, bitch, I smoke a lot of weed and I be a lot around a whole bunch of real ass niggas and a lot of real ass bitches at parties and shit. And bitches always wanna smoke. So, bitch, if I motherfucker at a party, bitch, and bitch, if bitches wanna smoke, bitch, I'ma have weed to sell. Like, why not, bitch? Everybody on their hustle, bitch. Everybody on their grand. Bitch, you two ain't paying me all that money like they supposed to be, baby. So, baby, don't, don't knock a bitch grand or bitch hustle. So, if you need some motherfucking weed, bitch, hit me. <laughs> I'm ghetto as hell, y'all. That's ghetto as hell. I'm on YouTube, somebody hit me up. You want to buy some weed? Jay Insanity video, y'all know. But that's not who we here to talk about. That's not who we here to talk about. Bitch, y'all know for a fact, One More Chance has been booming and grooming in the motherfucking things. Bitch, it's been episode after episode after episode that I have missed. I'm sorry for this. Y'all been putting in work. If y'all see my Halloween costume, I was a little nice. That's why I got this choke on, because y'all know that was my costume. I don't know if y'all, you know, been peeping, but bitch, I ate that shit up. <laughs> I ate that shit up. No, no spoon. So, yeah, bitch, like... motherfucking know that if they fucking with the realest bitch you gonna have to put in that motherfucking work and i've been putting in my work i've been making my name known across the motherfucking city and i want to sell weed while i'm doing that too so yeah fuck with a bitch so as y'all may know my bitch um shine ended up going home because she wasn't trying to deal with everybody beating up her all the motherfucking time she got her ass beat the fuck up in that boxing ring so she was just when she saw everybody else like really getting into it and like bitches really like getting smoking beef, that bitch ducked the fuck out. Plus she was a badass bitch. I'm pretty sure she had another nigga waiting on her somewhere. So she like, bitch, I'm going back home to my man. Bitch, you bitches is doing too much. And I don't blame her because like, girl, Skittles literally ran up on her for really like no reason because she got into it with Yoda. Look, Yoda was beating ass. Everybody who was beating ass in the boxing ring, they kind of got a little beef with the bitches that they was boxing. So now we at the new motherfucker episode. This was next episode when, um, we got Tokyo and the 
Roly Poly versus Big Sister, Little Sister. And, you know, they had that whole little feud where they came outside or whatever. And they was talking their shit, telling them, like, bitches, we into it. We're going to be into it forever. And that's one on the, the sisters all, um... Tokyo, like, bitch, I didn't mean to throw that bowl at your face. I meant to throw it at Roly Poly face. So, you know, they got the little tit for tat beef. Then we got, um, Bad and Bougie versus Yodala and Skittles. I guess they both don't like her. Wah, wah. Then we got Slim versus, like, fucking almost everybody. Like, everybody don't like the bitch Slim. And I live for her. Like, I love how mad that bitch be getting, like, it be a regular ass conversation and this bitch will literally just start getting mad as fuck out of nowhere. Like, girl, what is wrong? Like, we just literally sit there having a regular ass conversation and bitch, you literally just start shaking and screaming and she just like, bitch, I don't come back. Then she ran up on motherfucking um, Biggie girl. That girl better, that bitch gave her brick wall, bitch. I ain't going nowhere. That bitch tried to, she tried to rush through a, a 300 pound bitch. Girl, that's not gonna work. You little as hell, girl. Let me get my wings out the past the first episode that I missed. We were on the second episode that I missed. Okay, okay, we understand. I missed a lot of motherfucking episodes. Okay. And we got the seduction challenge or whatever. I didn't feel like I, that was shit was kind of like crazy to me because it was just like, y'all, you, every time Chance always say, oh, I want my one-on-one -on -one time and I want to I wanna get to know these bitches, but you have a seduction challenge for one minute where every bitch is either twerking or taking off their clothes. Like, you don't have a personality challenge or you don't have a, oh, what do you do with your life challenge, bitch. You out here just trying to see bitches twerk and play with, like, come on now. Like, I be hating that the corny shit that they be trying to do. Holy Poly um, fucking did her rodeo riding back thing. Bad and Bougie was being like weird and shit, like, oh, you can't touch it and all that. Like, I, I, okay, I was good for her, like, talking like that in the beginning, but, like, it's getting cringy. Like, at first it was, like, cute, but, like, now I'm like, okay, bitch. You keep fucking walking out around like you walking out the damn land like you a G.I. Joe fighter soldier. Every time they call it bad bitch, she say. Like, girl, you don't gotta do all that, bitch. Like, I'm, I would've tripped the fuck out of her. Like, bitch, why you keep walking like that? You're doing too much. Like, I understand you wanna be sex sexy all the time, but like, calm the fuck down. So then that's when um Flatback ended up going home. Cause I guess she didn't fucking do good in the challenge. I know low key she was going home because at the end of the day everybody was cool with her. So like if it's a bitch everybody cool with, like they not gonna fucking want to keep you because you don't have nothing to add to the show. Just like how Brown Sugar went home, bitch. The bitch nobody really like knew of her like after a while. Like bitch, we still mean all these bitches and you still have nothing that you've contributed so far. So bitch, goodbye. The girl sister, the smallest girl was on her period, so she couldn't really do the challenge. And then Tokyo would let him suck on her titty. And I'm like, girl, why would you let this random ass nigga suck on this titty? Like, I don't, I don't really, that's weird. Like, I'm not gonna let no random ass nigga just suck on my titty, whatever, queen. But if that's what you wanna do, that's what you wanna do. But bitch, if that nigga ain't give me no bag, bitch, you not sucking on shit. Period. The mama, no, the mama went home the first episode. The second episode, the white bitch went home. And on this episode, Brown Sugar and Flatback went home. Gay, okay, gay. Okay. So now, ooh, bitch, I'm so fucking, I'm sorry, y'all, I'm a little aggressive. So now we got the new episode. And I guess when the fucking. <laughs> When they had the elimination, they was talking about which one of the sisters had fucked with the security guard. And the sister was like, bitch, that wasn't me, bitch, that was my sister that had fucked with him. Like, I'm not finna go home. Now, do I feel bad for her right now, her sister, or would I have right out my sister to Like, if I know, like, bitch, my sister a hoe, like, bitch, I didn't grow up around you. I've been around you for years and years, and bitch. I know you a hoe, like, bitch, you've been the hoe in front of you, the hoe in front of our granny, you the hoe in front of God, all our cousins, all our aunties and uncles know you a hoe, like, bitch, you've been a hoe since we've been little. If, if that's the case, bitch, I'm not finna take the rap for you. When the shit hits the fan and it's like, oh, you out here fucking a security guard. Because, bitch, that's my name and we on TV, bitch. I'm not finna have everybody like, oh, that's that bitch that got sent home because she was fucking a security guard. When I know for a fact I didn't fuck no security guard. Now, if I fuck the security guard, then that's fan, bitch. I will take my rat and I will go home. But, bitch, you know damn well you didn't fuck the security guard and your sister fucked the security guard. I mean, she didn't have to necessarily say it was her sister. Yeah, but at the same time, bitch, that's better than not just saying, oh, somebody else. Because it's like somebody else, somebody else, somebody else, and you don't have no evidence. But if you, bitch, you say, oh, my sister did it, then, bitch, that means you ain't gonna lie because you just literally read it out your own blood. So, that was gaggy. I gagged when that happened. I don't know if Zeus put that up in there, but I really gagged. I was like, oh, my God, that bitch really just said her sister was off. Now, we start the episode with the sisters mad at each other. And Biggie said, like, you know, she had um, her sister back when Rudy was ground and pounding her ass and that was true like they wrote the clip the clip and bitch Rolly Polly was like Mow 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 like 
She was fucking meat mash on her shit. She was like, bitch, if Roly Poly, if she didn't jump in, bitch, Roly Poly would have killed your ass. And then that's like, regardless, like, if, if, if a bitch fight my sister, it don't matter if she get her ass beat or not, bitch, I'm gonna jump in, because, bitch, I'm just gonna jump in. That's just what the fuck you're supposed to do. You're saying, like, oh, next time you get your ass beat, she's just gonna let it happen. And I'm just like, okay, well, that's petty if you know damn well you was fucking a security guard, and it's not her fault that you was being a hoe. So if she gonna get in trouble for you being a hoe, like, that's not fair. They start getting an the argument. They she kick out her own sister out the room. She like, bitch, you gotta leave. They finna fight, kinda play fight, but they really know like, y'all not finna fight for her on TV. Bitch, that's a fool, bitch. You won't get on TV while all these bitches in the house and then fight your own sister over some dick. Like, come on now, don't be lame. Bad and Bougie and Roly Poly was outside on a little lot talking or whatever, and then um Slim walk in and she like, what are they talking about? They talking about Yodel and Skittles, and then they're talking about the twins, and they saying like how every time she you know she get into one of them like it's always a big group and it's going against her and it's like I mean Slim, for one girl I saw her, I just had a flashback of when her boobs came out and I don't know <laughs> I don't, don't want to be rude I'm a skinny bitch too but girl that shit look weird <laughs> that shit look weird bitch that shit look like two motherfucking erasers on her chest. That bitch had two number two pencil erasers sitting on her chest. That shit looked nasty. I'm just fucking sorry. I'm sorry. Before we begin to sing, I just had a flashback of that shit. She like, after, after, after she, you know, I mean, she got her ass to be better than big girl. But after girl, she like, hug the girl. I'm gonna be nice. We gonna get that when we get there. Slim say like, you know, they always need a pack. So that's when Slim say, um, she gonna say something like, she ain't gonna just say it like why they outside, but she'll go say it to their face. So that bitch bucked her shit, collected herself, and she said, bitch, she wanna go talk to her shit, so she felt this type of way. Cena, whatever, and Rodney Police said she gonna come with her, and it's Skittles, Yodola, and Soldier Girl. Now, I'm thinking, like, this is a click of the pretty bitches. Like, they probably don't have nothing, you know, against each other. Like, you know, they cool or whatever, so, like, ain't no beef or nothing like that, but... Fast as fuck, they start talking about how, like, you know, the sisters and how one threw another bus and they tell me how Chan's gonna send Smalls home. And then Soulja Girls be like, um, you the one who be with him all the time. I mean, Skittles told Soulja Girl, like, you the one who be with him all the time for his room. So that's when they, they saying, like, oh, do you out here giving your pussy out and fucking Chan's like, that's only gonna get you so far. What the fuck does that have to do with either one of y'all? Like, it gives me very hater vibes that y'all mad at Soulja Girl when that's supposed to be, y'all was supposed to be cool with her. Y'all trying to call her a hoe when the cameras come on. But y'all was just all sitting, like, Talking and like getting cool with each other and getting close, but now that she's talking to Chance more, oh, now y'all want to do her to do y'all a shit to her. So, like, I didn't fuck with Yodala or Skittles when they did that because it was just like, girl, if she fucking him, like, girl, that's her pussy, like, she can give it up if she want to give it up. Like, they don't have nothing new with y'all. Y'all all, all grown ass women, bitch. I'm about woman empowerment, bitch. Okay, if you give me your pussy up, that's your way of going about it, bitch. But I'm a type of bitch, I can fuck with a nigga, and I don't gotta fuck him with bitch. He gonna give me everything I want. Period. So I didn't like how they like was double teaming her and like trying to like, you know, out her a little bit, but at the same time, like, bitch, if you going upstairs every other fucking minute and they hear her moaning and shit from the room, like, like, bitch, be sneaky. If you're gonna be a hoe, bitch, be a sneaky hoe at least. She not, she not, um, fucking him. Like, who said something about fucking him? And then they was like, okay, well, you must be doing something with y'all up there, like kicking it and fucking playing hopscotch and shit, or what y'all doing? Like, you ain't just going up there for no reason. So now that's like, that's like, girl, if you fucking him, like, hit like Yummy. When Yummy said, bitch, she fucking him, bitch, yes, I am fucking him, because that was sickening, because he know, bitch, I'm fucking him. But if you clearly fucking him, and then you trying to lie and say you're not fucking him, and then we got to the mangina part, you clearly said that you was fucking him, when you still said in the kitchen that you wasn't, it just that's not it. Like, you could be a sneaky hoe, but don't be a lad hoe. If you want to be a hoe, be proud. I'm just saying. It's your life experience, and that's what the fuck you go through. Biggie and Smalls outside talking, and Biggie say that um, Smalls gave the girls ammo, because now they offer to be like, bitch, your sister threw you on the bus, and that's very true. She did get a bitch ammo. Like, all the bitches probably be talking about that. Biggie said, he goes, no ass, long pussy ass, slim coming out, and Rody whip neck right behind her. What I'm going to need Biggie to do is stop calling this bitch long pussy. Cause every time she said that shit, I fucking die. I literally fucking, bitch, why are you saying this bitch pussy is long? That is rude, bitch. You can't say, like, if you say a nigga dick small, that's fine. But if you say, bitch, yo dick fucking, like, skinny. Or you say, bitch, yo fucking balled up dick ass. Like, bitch, that's like, like, yo, bitch, yo, yo fucking dehydrated ass dick. Like, if a bitch said this to me, bitch, you gonna get smacked the fuck up, bitch. Who you talking about? Not this one over here, baby. We big packing over this motherfucker. You can never play with me. So if that bitch, every time you see her, that bitch say, yo, pussy is dehydrated. Bitch, what? My pussy, this bitch, what? <laughs> like, I just would not, I would have to take off on you just because you said that shit. Like, bitch, what do you mean my pussy is skinny? And then you say, look, and then she lift her shirt up and her pussy look like a thumb. <laughs> 
I just, I just want y'all to just stay on track. We all, let's just all stay on track. We got a lot to get through here, okay? We got um Slim coming out sad, popping her shit. She's talking about how Slim sell pussy on Facebook Live, and I'm like, oh my god, because this is what what I heard Manjana say up in the clip. So I guess Manjana gonna have some receipts about her selling pussy on Facebook Live, but bitch. If you selling your long dehydrated pussy, bitch, it should long pussy, long money, bitch. You should be checking the bag. Talk about how she was laid up with two ni niggas, and then Slim take her shoes off. So then now when she take her shoes off, she say, bitch, I'm popping you not. Be like, bitch, what's popping? She bitch was popping. Like what what's what, what's popping about you? That was no about Biggie and Smalls be having them one last. Mother is more Biggie. I see why they ain't saying home yet, cause that bitch mouth is really, 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 really ruthless. I wanna see what she say when her and man Jada sit down, cause out of everybody in the house, that bitch mouth is really cold. So they say Slim like she got she's twelve years old, Slim put her hair up, Rolly say that they got checked and they walk back in the house. So once they walk back in the house, um, Rolly say like y'all always double teaming people with y'all sister. Like y'all gotta stop doing that. Like let y'all be y'all own person. And then um, Rolly say like what have y'all accomplished? Like y'all have not done shit in y'all life. Like y'all 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 really nobodies. And then she said that shoes is leaning. Rolly, I don't. I mean, I live for you in the beginning, but I don't know what hierarchy that you feel like. I mean, you is a big big ass bitch. So therefore, bitch, you won't you gonna be the alpha bitch of the house because you the biggest one. But bitch, don't be telling no bitch, oh, what have you done with your life on? Bitch, we only know you from Zeus. We do not, we did not know you before this show. So you was on last season, you popped your shit, you did your shit, but don't come this season telling bitches that, that we just now meeting two us because of this show about they self, like you mother, like that for real. Like after this show, you didn't want to go sign some record deals and some TV shows and did a tour. Because bitch, Rolly Polo, you still sucking dick on only fans. Well, not sucking dick, but sucking... Bitch, lions and tigers and bears, whatever you can find to suck on to get a view, bitch, you sucking on this. So don't do hoes like that. But I live for you trying to be mother. You could be mother right now, but don't be mother as if, like, bitch, what have you accomplished? Because, really, what have you accomplished? Okay. Okay. So now Slim walk over all up in their face. Like, <coughs> Slim, I'm going to let you know this. One thing about fighting big-ass bitches, you do not want to be close enough for they can grab you, push you, anything like that. For one, we little, okay? We some, look, we some little bitches. This all I got. So, if a bitch push me, I'm gonna fly. Cause I'm small, I don't weigh that much. You going all in these bitches faces like you fucking six feet, 300 pounds, girl, like, what, girl, what you thought this, like, you not, you not giving that. So what we gonna do, we gonna just react to the fight. Cause I want y'all to see my reaction to what the fuck happened because bitch, this bitch ran up, like, it run up, get done up. Slim, girl, you you talking all this shit since you got here. And, girl, she fucking, girl, she fucking big body Joe ass. Like, she had you out here like you, she definitely little girl the fuck out of you. This bitch walked up in her face like she was the toughest bitch in the world. This bitch pushed this bitch across the world. She big body. Whoa. Like, you got body, girl. Like, she... Why do you feel like you can rush that big-ass bitch? This bitch is a thousand fucking pounds. What made you feel like you was gonna run through her or, like, do her as if, like, she was a little bitch where you can, like, run up, run through that bitch? Like, that's not a bitch you run up on. You don't run up on big bitches. You you just pipe them hoes and keep hitting that big ass till they get tired. All that running up and trying to grab you and shit, bitch. Look, bitch, you got your ass. Call me, call me high, bitch. That bitch said, honey, honey, ha. Bitch, she said, honey, honey, ha. <laughs> Look. Yeah, bitch. <laughs> and then it just scuffles because she snatched out the fuck up. Now, she was swinging at the bottom, no doubt. She had connected some of her punches at the bottom. She was cute with her little MMA leg lock. But at the end of the day, girl, like, she got you. She got you, no doubt. She, she got you, like, she didn't even have to swing on you. And you could tell that, like, if that bitch, if one on the security, she would have, she would have. Woo woo slam woo 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 ground and pound. She would have sat on your ass and just you can't be running up on no big ass bitch and be just be thinking that you finna run through her or no girl you gotta hit a bitch with speed. That's the only thing that's gonna happen your side when you fighting a big bitch is speed, bitch. Other than that, the bitch power she probably big so she got a lot of weight so her punch is gonna hurt more than yours. The bitch got a lot of body so she can be able to push and maneuver you where the fuck you wanna go. All you need to be worried about is why that bitch pushing, maneuvering, doing all that fuck. But you gotta be just tagging that bitch a million, whoop, 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 tagging that bitch a million miles per hour, and you didn't do that. You got your ass dragged. Got dragged. Her titties, the titties came out, girl. At the end, girl, I didn't know what the fuck was going on. So now, my bitch Mangina comes back. Now this is when the shit got lit, cause this bitch Mangina 
first season, like, he was being, like, aggressive with the bitches, but this time, like, he had the okay from Chance to be aggressive. And Chance, for you to be a straight man, bringing back drag girls <laughs> to talk to women to try to fight them, like, I did not live how he was jumping in their faces. Like, of course, he can beat their ass like he a man. So, you jumping in their face, like, trying to make them scared, like, that's, that's not, I don't, I don't like, I don't, me personally, I just don't feel the need to jump in a girl's face to make her intimidated by me, because at the end of the day, bitch, I'm a boy, so you should know when speaking to me, I could beat your ass. So speak to me as if I could beat your ass. But at the same time, like, I don't even come at girls like that because it's a bitch wild, but I need to fight a girl. Like, I've been fighting niggas my whole life. What will make me want to, like, if a bitch play with me, you can get your shit smacked. No bad for a girl play with me, but you can get your shit dragged and you can get that one. But I, I would try to my best to refrain from disrespecting a girl so it gets to that point just off the simple fact that I have a lot of respect for women. That's just it. Mangina say, um... Bad and Bougie was just with some Chicago niggas and she got kids that she don't claim. Smiley got her only fans. Slim still pussy on Facebook. And then Chance gave man Gina earbud to go talk to the bitches. So when they sit down, first he got smiles and show her a picture of her twerking on OnlyFans. This bitch still smiling. This man literally has a video of you shaking your ass for free. For one bitch, I would say put that shit away. Bitch, that's OnlyFans. Bitch, you gotta pay to see that. You showing the cameras and all this other shit. Me striking my ass on OnlyFans. Bitch, this is OnlyFans. So read that mean you gotta pay for that shit. So don't be out here motherfucker giving free promo all this. You gonna cut me a check. Fuck you talking about smiling. Bitch, I'm smiling. Bitch, you should've ate his ass up. Ate her ass up. She left her smiling, still looking stupid. Then Dottie came drunk as fuck. Why Dottie always drunk? Then everybody else noticed that this bitch always slurring and drunk as fuck all fucking day. Like, girl, get that shit together. But you supposed to be here with she having withdrawals from her mama. Like, bitch, that shit not cute. Like, what the fuck? Asked her, like, does your mama live with you? And she said, what does her name mean? And she told her, and then she said, they was finna fight because his fingers now facing him. And Johnny wasn't listening to Chance because they was all running through the living room and shit. <laughs> he said, bitch, you got on leave ass. Bitch, how we wanted in my high school. <laughs> bitch, you wanted in my high school. Bitch, you got on leave ass. When well, Levi makes some good ass jeans, when I play with them, like, um, I mean, I don't know who will leave ass, but if I'm trying to dress them up, you know, how my love, my love man cunt day, where I'm having my little trench coat, my, I'm gonna throw some Levi jeans on, because this is just crispy, bitch. It's a difference between having regular jeans and Levi jeans. So Levi is just a boozy bitch type of jeans. I don't know what he meant by that, but I'm in the Midwest, okay? We fuck with Levi ass. Bitch. So the girl talking to man Gina and they tell him something about the world don't know. Uh, he asked her like, did she get that pussy up? And that's when she was like, what? He was like, um, did she get that pussy up? And she kept like beating around the bush about did she fuck Chance or not? And that's when she finally like said like, yeah, she fucked him. And he's like, girl, that's a mess. So she confirmed that she had Chance sex with Chance. And then she confirmed that she has two baby daddies and two kids. So he like, bitch, if you here for, if you here for another motherfucking baby daddy, cause you out here just popping that pussy all around the world and getting motherfucking babies, and these niggas not cut for you. So what the fuck are you doing here? And I, 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 at that point, I couldn't even be mad at man Johnny, cause at that point, bitch, yeah, you already fucking him, and then you got kids at home, like, what, you, what you doing? Like, you trying to secure the bag, sis? Like, if you trying to secure the bag, just say that. You up there fucking him, bitch? You probably gonna be the next bitch pregnant at the next season when we see the next season, season three, and we got the bitch pregnant in the house. It's gonna be her. Period. <laughs> and them come. And she giving uh, attitude, and he asked like, why she so mad? Cause Slim was giving a lot of attitude, but she, if you hearing a lot of bitches are yelling and shit, y'all waiting in the back to talk to him, you know it's gonna be some aggressive shit going on. So I already know she was gonna be come on edge. So he asked about like, what you doing on Facebook? <laughs> like, what you doing on Facebook? And he like, um, bitch, what you mean? So then that's when Man Johnny get up, and then that's when she get up, and then Man Johnny push her, push him, and then she try to like run up on him, and then she's like, why you selling pussy on Facebook? And then Slim throw a drink on him, and then. And, and, Bitch, it is motherfucking cracking. I see why, like, when I was watching this shit, I see why everybody keep texting me like, bitch, one more chance, one more chance, one more chance, one more chance, because, bitch, they is going to fuck nuts. Everybody, like, every aspect of the show is going crazy. Chance is DL. Let's talk about it. Let's just get Chance is DL. He, talk, he got a house full of bitches, and he keep bringing the nigga back. What's going on? I don't, I don't understand. You got all these bitches, and you bring them away. Ah, 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 okay, all right, I'm gonna give it to you. My bitch is entertaining, but at the same time, you could have, I mean, I, I don't, you could have had Yoda or well, Roddy Poli. Roddy Poli would have been the per per perfect person to sit and talk to the bitches, but you bring back the vagina as a special guest. Come on, out, chance. You got a, food, a house full of bitches and you like sucking dick. <laughs> Anyways, with motherfucking kinky twist to your head, girl. You got kinky twist, micros one day. Girl, stop playing with me, chance. 
Stop, girl, stop playing with me, Chan. That's the motherfucking video. I hope I enjoyed it, y'all. I hope I got to all the points that I was supposed to come across with these one more chance videos. If there's anything that I left out, please comment below, and I will definitely reply to your message. We can talk about it and chat it up, and I'll put it in my next review. If I just motherfucking video makes you stop in that like button, stop on this like button, like how bad and bougie and Yodel is finna fight. I know their fight is coming. And that is gonna be one for the work. So I know Bad and Bougie got them bitches. Yoda did her shit in the boxing ring. So I wanna see what these bitches gonna give. They got all this math and they got all this motherfucking tough Tony light skin energy. Bitch, what y'all gonna do? Who gonna be the red? Who gonna be the reddest bitch out of the fight over? Let me know in the comments who y'all think gonna fight next. I definitely feel like Slim is gonna try to keep coming to prove herself because she low key probably pumped. Cause they did low key. She big bodied you like. I'm a little bitch and I've never been big body. I mean, in wrestling, when I was a wrestler, if y'all, if anybody know me, I can my real thing, and y'all know I was a wrestler back in the day. And bitch, I have been big body by wrestling bitches, but like fighting wise, bitch, I know how to do it. Like, but that's, that's wrestling, so I have to grab you, bitch. If I'm swinging, bitch, you're not finna big body me shit, cause you're not finna get close enough to do that, cause this motherfucker reach right here, bitch. This long ass reach right here, bitch. Six feet, ho. Six feet. That's a wonderful video, y'all, and same gang, since we out.